Hello, um, today we are going to talk about how to solve the legal question 1309 legal question decrypting string from alphabet to integer mapping. So um, basically we're mapping some um, numbers to its corresponding um, English alphabets and they are um, so characters A to I are represented by 1 to 9 and characters J to Z are represented by 10 pound to 26 pound. Um, so for example, 10 pound is J and 11 pound is K and 12 uh, is actually 1 is A and 2 is B. So for here, 1 is A. 3 is C, 26 pound is Z. So basically we're just mapping it. So um, for mapping we have to create a dictionary, right? So just create a dictionary mapping uh, and putting the key as, um, so the number plus is pound as is key and um, the English alphabet is value. So I'm gonna put my dictionary here. So this is my dictionary. So you can see that the keys are the numbers and um, the values are the English alphabets that is mapping to. So after we are done creating the dictionary, um, we have to check um, there are two scenarios. One is it's a two-digit number followed by a pound. In this case, we have to map it, um, like a map the two-digit number together. If it's um, not a two-digit number followed by a pound, like this, we should map it just to um, one, just the single digit to an English alphabet. So there are two cases. Um, so after we check the cases, um, we should return the result. And the result should be um, just the English alphabet that we are getting. So let's um, initialize i to the zeroth position because we're traversing through the zeroth position. And while i is less than length of uh, the string. So we are writing the first um, scenario if um, s plus 2 is equal to pound and we are also making sure um, it's not out of range. So if it's a two-digit number followed by a pound, then we also have a, to initialize the result as an empty string. So the result would be the dictionary, and our key is s i to i plus 2. 